everyone, it's Nisha. So today I wanted to share with you a few products that I've been enjoying so much and are so useful um, that I thought I have to share them with you. And none of them are makeup. But I think most of you need those things in your life. I'm going to start off with is the best makeup mirrors. You might remember that before Christmas I got sent makeup mirror from Easy Hold and I absolutely love it because right here it is. There it is. It's a LED mirror so it has light and it has different type of light so it has a couple of warm ones and couple of cool lights which I think is great because if you're wondering why do you have all these different type of lights so if you are getting ready depending where you are going use that light so if you think you are going to a restaurant when the lighting is warm and low then get ready in that light because that's how your makeup will look if you are going shopping you know you will be in stores with those bright a fluorescent lights then get ready in the bright uh, fluorescent light and then you've got daylight as well so if you're going out just going to be outside get ready in that light so this has loads of features it has all these lights and you can dim them you can make them brighter it also comes with this magnifying one that is um, magnetic which is fantastic it's it just looks so beautiful it's got this rose gold with white it's very very um, weighty and I compared it that day to the glam call Ricky mirror which it's a good mirror but it's just four times I think magnification so you don't have any other option and it's very light it, and it costs like over hundred pounds whereas this I think is $39 or something like that and you can buy them on Amazon or their own website and I think they ship worldwide so I've got some discount codes I'm not getting paid for it or don't get any commission those discount codes are just for you and obviously they've sent me these mirrors for free but I thought I showed them because since then they showed they've sent me a couple more and I thought if I show you all three of them you can decide which one is best for you and because it depends on what where you would be using it oh my god i've got hair in my hair in my eye um they all come with a lovely cleaning cloth and usb charger so they are rechargeable because someone asked me oh will the cable fit in every country yes it will because it's usb so it's just like your phone um charger so that was this one i think this one might be I don't know if it's the most expensive, but this one is the most robust and weighty one. They all are beautiful quality. Okay, so for example, I use this mirror um, upstairs where I get ready. Um, now, there is another one. What is this one called? This one is called Mott Pro, M-O-T Pro. So again, this one is quite heavy. This all is plastic, but it must have, I don't know, it's heavy. So this one opens up like a book. I don't wanna show you the reflection of everything in front of me. But basically, again, it's a touch screen where you can turn it on. But I think with these ones, to turn it on, yeah there is a switch right at the back so you can <clears throat> so to operate it you have to turn it on at the back it's got a button here you won't be able to see it and then you do it with the touch screen again it has different types of lights so here is the uh, bright white one this is like really bright cool white then you have the warmer it won't show in in a, in the camera but anyway 
and you have these two extra um, panels so these two are magnifying and this one isn't magnifying so I suppose you can just see yourself from this side so again I think this one is really good to have it in your on your vanity because it is quite big well it's not big but you know what I mean it's the biggest out of them all and when you're not using them using it you can just close it like this so it also doesn't get dirty you can turn it any way you want as well again comes with a lovely cloth comes with an extra magnifying mirror but this one is not not magnetic this one is the one that has suckers and to be honest i'm not really keen of the on this that you have to lick and stick on i prefer the magnetic one that that is genius but i use this anyway or if i'm because this is 10 times magnifying or if i need to look really closely i will just hold it or have it in my handbag as well so it's just something extra you have magnification in that mirror anyway and the third one is called mini desktop makeup mirror and this one is the lightest and probably the simplest but again you've got the button to turn it on and then you've got touch screen here can you see again you can change the color and also also you can take this off and to me this is a, a brilliant traveling mirror because it's quite light and you could just pack it like this you could actually pack it because let me just show you how beautiful how beautifully and safely packaged they come so this box is beautiful then you have this um, really robust plastic bit where all the parts go and i think what i would do i would put that in this just plastic insert and pack it like that because whenever i go away uh you know even if you're in a hotel you might have a mirror in place that it's not really in a good lighting or it's inconvenient whereas with this you know you can go and sit anywhere and you've got the lights as well it's so easy to just you put it in and turn it and it's done so this i mean yeah of course you can use it every day on your vanity but i think this one is quite nice as a, a traveling mirror and i might actually travel with that so all these mirrors are similar in a sense that they all have touch screen to change the uh, temperature of the lighting and they are all usb rechargeable but depending what you are after how you use your mirrors which one you would choose so i thought i'd show you all three of them i mean to me they all three are very useful in fact the first one i probably use more down here when i uh, do my tutorials and uh, this one i will probably use on my vanity and that one for traveling as we're talking about mirrors let me show you this i've been using this for years but when i thought i would be talking about the mirrors this came to mind this is foaming mirror and glass cleaner this might not be anything new to you but i remember discovering it years and years ago from betterwear catalog do you remember betterwear it's a bit like avon they used to come and drop a little catalog through your door and once i've tried this i never stopped but then i don't know if better West still exists or not but oh, i didn't have one in my local area i don't know but for a while i didn't have it and then i started finding it on amazon i think lakelands do them i actually don't know where this one is from it might be from amazon i will find it for you but this like this is like the best thing ever to clean your mirrors to clean glass anything is so quick no smudges no streaks let me actually show you on one of my mirrors how i use it so all you need is paper kitchen towel let me do this mirror you shake this spray it can you see the foam and then oops 
turned it on. And then, let me turn it off here. That's it. And then you just clean it and it's done. It's got no streaks, nothing. It's just amazing. I use it on my glass coffee table. I use it obviously on all my mirrors. And also I use it on, you know, like high gloss furniture. So do you remember the black uh, sideboard that I have? I use that on this as well because it doesn't smear, you know, the, the smears just disappear and dry straight away. Okay, the next product that I found so, so helpful, and I don't know why I didn't buy it earlier, I've had it for a while now, is this mixing makeup palette. So, you know, I like to mix my foundations if I want to make them darker or lighter, any cream products really, and I usually mix it on my hand. And what happens is half of it just sinks into your skin straight away. So you waste a lot. And also then you have a dirty hand. So I found this so helpful. I squeezed a couple of foundations. You, this comes with a spatula, it's so inexpensive. I think that was like not even five pounds. Mix it and then actually apply it with the spatula. I find it so, so helpful. You know, if you also like using uh, the like cream foundation palette that makeup artists use and I have a couple of those and I sometimes mix those colors as well. It's so, so useful and it's very inexpensive. Now this is genius. So you know how much I love um, sheet masks and I usually use the Solista masks and uh, they are wonderful. But one thing that's always annoyed me about them is that once you stick them onto your face, you have to lie still, which I can't do, because otherwise they will slide off your face. Well, I found on Amazon this. And this is basically silicone mask with these ear taps. So what you do, you put your sheet mask on, then you put that on the top, hook this behind your ears, and that will keep your mask in place. And then you just rinse it because this is silicone, dry it, and you can use it again and again and again. I thought honestly that this was genius because that has made me use my masks more often because I can put the mask on, stick this on to secure it and I can do stuff. You know, sometimes if I put the mask on and I know I have to just lie there and do nothing, I feel like, when can I take this mask off? You know, I need to get on with stuff. Whereas with this, I can get on with whatever I want to do. I can bend down and I know that the mask won't slip. So I think you need this. If you love your masks, you need this. Now, a couple of household, another household gadgets. This, I know, not very exciting, but this excites me a lot. And this made my life so easy. This is like a portable kitchen bin. So what you do, you hook this onto your cupboard. So you open one of your kitchen cupboards, hook this on, close the head cupboard. And you know, if you're peeling anything, like your potatoes, onions, or you make a salad, I used to be so annoyed to go with every bit of peeling into my bin because my bin is not under where I prepare my food. It's a walking distance away, <laughs> not a long walking distance. But you know what I mean. This honestly made my life so much easier because what I used to actually do, if I was peeling anything, I would collect all newspapers and I would just, you know, spread a newspaper on my kitchen surface and peel everything on that and then throw it into the bin. Whereas now I've got this. And you know, you don't have to use it just as a bin. This stands on its own. So you could use it for storing anything in it. You could use it in your bathroom. This actually came in a pack of two, this one and a white one. So I have couples, I can have them 
spread around the kitchen and I actually have it hanging on my cupboard constantly um, all day so whenever I need to do something I stick things in there and at the end of the day I just empty it obviously not smelly things but you know what I mean <laughs> um, and the last thing is this and this is one of those motion lights so you know in my hallway I have a row of cupboards but the hallway is quite dark like for example I keep in there all my gel polishes and whenever I go to open the cupboard I can't see anything so this um, I have one already in the cupboard and I kept this one out before I put it in there to show you so basically this is a magnet strip with the 3M adhesive so you peel this off stick it wherever you want in your cupboard and then you stick this light onto it um, this one's got on and off switch is that on or off and auto so I suppose you want it on auto so every time it detects motion it comes on oh, you won't be able to see it in here but it's a, a bright white light and also this is rechargeable so again it comes with a usb and you can use any one let's have a look i probably can even use the one from the mirrors because they are pretty universal yeah i've just used the charger from from the mirrors and obviously then you need a plug with the usb point so it's also rechargeable and this has made my life so much easier as well with um you know so if you have if you have any dark cupboard you can put it in your wardrobe in cupboard with clothes in any dark place like in one of my cupboards out there i also have um like a big cupboard that is laundry cupboard and that is really dark whenever i open it so i have one of those in there as well so that's all for now I thought I really had to share them with you because I thought if I'm excited about it and they make my life easier, I love gadgets anyway. I think it's rubbed off on me from my husband because he's a proper gadget man. Um, I thought I need to share it with you. Okay, my lovelies, I hope you enjoyed this video. That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching and stay fabulous. Bye.